Yo, what is going on everyone? My name is Scotty. Welcome back to a brand new Black Ops 4 video. In today's video, what I have for you guys is a best class setup specifically for the map Nuketown in which you can use to absolutely destroy the other team. Hey everyone, my name is Scotty and thank you for tuning back into the channel. So today we'll be looking at an insane GKS setup in which I specifically run for Nuketown that I have been absolutely loving. This gun shreds at every single range, whether it be close, medium, or far, and it's just an absolute beast to run. So without further ado, let's get into the class up itself. For this class up, I'll be using the GKS, and the GKS is a full auto SMG with low recoil and high accuracy at long ranges, making it basically the little brother of the ICR. So let's get into the attachments itself. Starting off, I use grip 1, which reduces the recoil while aiming down the sights. The next attachment after that is the long barrel, giving me more damage at longer ranges. After that is long barrel 2, which makes your bullets hit the targets faster, letting you win more gunfights. And the last one I use is the Extendamex for an increased ammo capacity, bringing it to over 50 bullets. Now moving on to the gear, I use the stim shot, so I can heal faster and more often, while being able to shoot while healing. In a small and fast paced map like Newtown, the stim shot is very important to use. And now after that, moving on to the perks. The first one that I use is Scavenger. I use Scavenger so I can get more ammo off of dead bodies, and if you play Crash, you can replace perk 1 with a Tack Mask instead, since Crash gives you ammo pack. For perk 2, I am running Gung Ho, which lets you fire your weapon, use equipment while running, and as well, you can aim down your gun faster after running, and reload while running too, making this an essential perk for the SMG. Now moving after the gun itself is the score streaks. For the score streaks on Nuketown, I like to run the UAV, Attack Chopper, and Strike Team. But if you run with a team that is always constantly dropping UAVs, you can switch out the UAV for another score streak. I would definitely recommend switching UAV out for a Mantis, as it is godly on modes like Hardpoint and Domination. You can manually control the Mantis or let it run around on its own, and it absolutely destroys with its rockets. Now after the score streaks, I'm going to talk about the specialists I use. Now for the specialists, I recommend using Firebreak, as this Pure Fire and Reactor Core are both super deadly on a close range map like Nuketown. The Pure Fire can give you easy kill feeds, and the Reactor Core is easy for clearing out houses if you do not know how many are inside. If the fire break is taken, I would also recommend using Crash for the extra health from the TAC-5 and the extra points and damage from the assault packs that he drops very constantly. So guys, this is my best class up for the map Nuketown. I hope you guys did find this informative and as well enjoyed the video. If you did, make sure to hit that like button for more Call of Duty content here on my channel. And if you are new, I would definitely recommend hitting that subscribe button to stay tuned here on my channel and as well help me hit the goal of 1000 subscribers in which I'm so close to hitting. So also on a side note, I've been thinking about making more videos like this for specific map class setup. So besides Nuketown, I can make other ones for firing range, slums, and all kinds of other maps in Black Ops 4. So if you are definitely interested in seeing that, leave a comment down below and hit the like button because that will definitely make me want to make more of these kind of videos. But as I said guys, I hope you all did enjoy. My name is Scotty. Peace out, take care, and thanks for watching.